Hey everyone, Senior Bowl of course rages on in Alabama. It's really cold in New York. It seems like it's warmer in Mobile. So let's get on with the action and talk about players who are playing well on the turf in Alabama. We'll start at the top at the quarterback position. Mike Glennon bouncing back, had a little bit of a, a weird first day or two, but has looked good since, has been hitting his receivers in stride, making good, quick, sound decisions. So maintains his spot as the quarterback that might go first. Uh, of all the quarterbacks if Geno Smith is not in fact the guy to do so. So keep an eye on Mike Lennon. I apologize for the baby giraffe comment that was out of line. Next up at the running back position, another player who seems to have separated himself, at least according to scouts at the game, Kenyon Barner from Oregon, the running back, came back for a senior season last year to improve his draft stock and did so immensely. Good field vision, great speed, really good hands catching the ball out of the backfield and is familiar with the system, of course, that has become so du jour in the NFL. So Kenyon Barner looking quite good as a, as a running back pick in the, at the senior bowl. Next up. At wide receiver, Quentin Patton, decent size out of Louisiana Tech, playing in that wide open Sunny Dykes air raid system. The most complete, thorough NFL wide receiver at the Senior Bowl. Has a high football IQ, runs his routes quite well, very good hands, good speed. Seems to be the complete package. Probably won't be a first round pick, but is getting closer and closer to being one of the first 32. Next up, Denard Robinson. I don't know what there is to say about Denard Robinson for the NFL, but has struggled a little bit catching the ball in the return game. But once he gets in the open field, he has been quite good. Still a tweener. We don't know if he's going to be playing running back or receiver. He's been working out with the receivers, but it, it really is a struggle to figure out where he's going to fit in with the NFL other than perhaps specialty packages and in the return game. But he has struggled a little bit at the senior bowl practice session. So somebody to keep your eye on. An intriguing prospect because of his athleticism and versatility, but again, has struggled. Going to the defensive side of the ball, Kawan Short from Purdue. Really versatile guy. Long arms, big body, has been bull rushing the crap out of the offensive lineman. Really strong, almost unblockable. Can play the nose tackle, can play inside in a 4-3, can play the, the defensive end position in a 3-4, can do all sorts of things. Was thought of to be a first round prospect in 2012. Came back, had an up and down season for Purdue, but has been great at practices thus far. And finally, Dayton Jones, the athletic and large defensive end from UCLA, coming in around 280 pounds, but carries it very well. Has been blowing people up with power moves, speed moves, very agile, very athletic. Has experience in both the 4-3 and 3-4, playing the defensive end position. So. Perhaps not a first round pick, but is moving up people's draft boards and has just, he's caused a lot of mayhem in backfields thus far at the Senior Bowl. So let us know who's moving up in your mind at the Senior Bowl or otherwise in the comments. We'll see you soon.